Hello my beautiful friends and welcome back to my channel. It's your favorite vocal coach Tanya Levy back on track. Yes, I was on a really really long break. Yes, I lost 10 kilos. You might not recognize me and yes, I'm back in Germany. I'm not anymore in Singapore. My life has changed quite a lot and if you want to know what happened to me then Please go on and watch the video with the TNT boys that I made because I haven't seen any video from the TNT boys in two years and my reaction was very su surprisingly or su I was very surprised about their voice change. So please watch that video here. It's the last video that I uploaded and there will be more videos regularly here on the channel. Now give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and let me know in the comment section what you want to see next. Let's start. Look at me, you may think you see who I really am, but you never know me every day. It is if I play a part. Now I see if I wear a mask, I can fool the world, but I cannot fool my heart. make a small little break the last time I saw Aneth was uh, the videos that I reacted to when she was in the show um, in the junior idol show and I'm really really happy to see that her voice sounds so much more clearer and so much more healthy she did uh, had a very raspy voice it was very breathy and I feel that it's much more clearer now and uh, yeah it sounds uh, sounds healthier now it's so nice to see both girls I don't know the other girl um, but she sees, seems to be also very successful uh, on her YouTube channel and doing covers now she has a different kind of type or timbre than Anna's Anna, Anna's voice is very very uh, higher you can really hear the the um the head voice resonance there and i really like that small roof that she added and the head voice that she done in some parts the other girl has a much lower timbre and yeah let's continue oh i love that harmony thing cool that I believe in somehow I will show the head voice head voice so beautifully they both in one harmony that's exactly what we want to listen to right that's exactly what every vocal coach loves is when two beautiful girls hit those beautiful notes and sing unisono that's what the Germans say and um, yeah they sound the same both have the same vibrato and somehow that's the Ariana Grande vibrato I guess because they both make those distinctive vibrato riff please listen to it that's so interesting to see and it reminds me so much of Ariana Grande I have to be fair as a vocal coach and I think it's my responsibility now 
I'm back in Germany with all my students here. We are over 30 students in a week. And it's so, so important that you have a really good posture because what happens is that you take away, you taking away the power from some muscles that you need. Now, for example, if you lay over, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to post a picture here that I really like and that I show my students. If you lean over casually when you sing, then you, that muscles that you use to stabilize your larynx, the elevator muscles or the neck, you know, the, the movement of power goes to your pharyngeal area, to your neck area. And that can cause you to strain if you sing. You know, do you know those people that when they sing from their necks, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show you an example here. Now, if I'm going to do that, yeah, that, then the power is here on my neck. And it will sound very strained and, and, and sometimes very uh, narrow or squeezed or metallic. And the power is just in the neck. And then there are some students that really need those posture lifts so they can stand straight. In Estil, in the Estil method, there is head and neck anchoring that helps you to stabilize and take power back from bigger muscles in uh, your in your back. That's what you need. So this would be my students, I would tell them girls, you really have to have a good posture, it's really important when you sing because the larynx will drop down and can cause you also to, 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 to strain and to change the pitch for example. Also you cannot breathe properly like you could because the diaphragm is a little bit, you know, it's in an uncomfortable position so it's important that your diaphragm um, is also not leaned over, uh, that you have enough um, um, possibility to breathe into your lungs. Uh, sorry, you know that English is not my first language, so I'm really trying my best here. But so that's really important what I want to say. Head and neck anchoring, make sure that you have proper movement to breathe. And also, I think aesthetically, just aesthetically, I want to. I want, I, want, I want people to put some effort in their singing. I think that's important. And I think if you just hang around in there occasionally, I don't, I don't really think that singing is a body thing and you are using your whole body to express yourself. Your vocal folds are very tiny muscles, very tiny little muscles, and you use those muscles and help them, you know. Don't put all the lift on those really tiny muscles. Make sure you bring your whole body into it. And it's, it's an occasion where you sing, you are on stage, you're performing. So it's put on your best behavior. You know what I mean? So I think that's really, really important. And I'm gonna end this here on a really good note, yeah? And show me in the comments, let me know in the comments what you would like to see next. Don't forget to subscribe, thumbs up, and yeah, please watch that video here with the voice winner Claudia. And here is another video of Anif. I see you in my next video.